This is the linear actuator, 12 volts, that I'm going to run with an Arduino Micro, a MOSFET, and two buttons. So, how is it all wired up? First of all, we got 5 volts coming in here. I got a capacitor here, 100 UF, just to protect from spikes. So we got 5 volts running down this side on the breadboard. On this side, we got 12 volts, and there is also a capacitor here for 100 UF. Over here, we got the MOSFET, and then we just have a regular button. Now, the linear actuator I'm using is a 12 volt. It's a 50 millimeter one, and it moves 40, 4 millimeters per second, and it has a push and pull of a 150 Newton, which is about 15 uh, kilogram force. So, first of all, the MOSFET is connected uh, to the ground on the 12 volts here, you can see, and that is the, the outer right side on the MOSFET. I'm going to move this so you can see a little better. So, this side is, is connected here to the, to the first leg, and that is to the ground. And then we have the Arduino connected to pin number three. Right now I'm not controlling it with the code from the Arduino, I'm controlling it through, through the button, but I'm still connecting it because I'm going to do that later. So it's connected to pin number three on the Arduino, and it's connected on, on the outer side, uh, left side, on the MOSFET. Now we also have a resistor here, which is 10K, uh, and the last pin that we connect is the middle one, and we connect that to the actuator. Now, actually it's connected to the button, which is connected to the actuator. Now the actuator is connected to the 12 volts on this side here, and then you have uh, the other side, the ground, uh, is connected to the one side of the button on the legs, and here we have the other one. So when I push the button, we get the movement. And that's about it.